Assalamu alaikum. My name is Haya, and I just have one question for you tonight. Islam is a religion of peace and freedom of thought and freedom of speech. So why in the Quran does it say that if a Muslim who is born a Muslim should be punished by death if he chooses not to follow the religion anymore? Sister, you said the Quran says that a person who is born as a Muslim and he changes his religion, he's put to death. Sister, I don't know of any verse in the Quran. You point out in the Quran, there's no such verse in the Quran talking about that a person who is a Muslim and then who changes his faith, he should be put to death. But there are certain rulings. But if you go back to the history, the theory of the Prophet, Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, we know that when the Prophet went to Medina, there was one Sahaba who came and said that when the Prophet said, go and kill these kafirs, they're causing problems, they're the enemies. So one of the Sahaba said that, please forgive my brother. And the Prophet didn't kill him. And later on, that person accepted Islam. So it's not a general rule that any person who's a Muslim who becomes a murtad, he has to be put to death. The ruling is, if a person who is a Muslim, who becomes a murtad, who changes his faith and propagates against the religion of Islam, then the penalty is death. And this is in most of the countries. For example, if in the country of India, there's a citizen of India who shares the secret prince of the Indian army with the enemy. The Indian law will say he should be put to death or life imprisonment. This is the same law in America, same in UK for apostasy. The same law that is there that if you sell your some secret of the country, either death penalty or life imprisonment. So in Islam, it is not a normal ruling that a person who is a Muslim, when he becomes a non-Muslim, he should be put to death. Only if he propagates against Islam and conspires against Islam, then is the ruling of death, sister. Hope that answers the question, sister. Thank you so much. Yes, you did. The most welcome, Thank sister. Paradise, those who practice Islam go to paradise and the rest of the people go to the hell.